can do it yeah i just did an unboxing video uh, you know this is a better angle my wife i look better here yeah then is it the lighting is it because of the lighting oh because i just did an unboxing video on that side guys and i look puffy and big yeah this is from michael <laughs> yeah his package finally arrived and i hope yeah i will have breakfast guys and yes i am using the binaural this is another one this has um sunflower seeds <coughs> i will just eat two slices because when i eat four in the morning it's not morning it's past 12 o'clock uh, lunch time but i since for me this is morning uh, because we woke i woke at about 9 30 so for me this is morning <coughs> i don't i'm not i'm like michael i don't usually i will have vegetable butter guys and i wish you could smell it uh the taste is very good but i prefer real dairy but since i can't have it but the taste is very good it tastes like normal butter and um it's so soft guys it's not like normal dairy you know that is hard this is so soft like um, so that's good and the smell god because it's rapeseed and you can i mean it's not the same but yeah i love real butter as well um, you know it's real butter is uh, fattier but you get used to it but this one is also very good we have tried other butter before vegetable butter and they were not good so i will just yeah i'm rambling i will just put butter on each i don't put a lot oh maybe this was a lot but yeah and what I'm having is uh, curry seal so it's curry with I think seal is herring in English <coughs> so it's mayonnaise with uh, fish um, I have discovered that if I eat fish seafoods and eggs when it's cold I don't get any harms but with dairy i get a uh, loose stool and a lot of them and three times a day so i will not eat there or i will avoid eating a lot so so dairy i can have but it seems that it's okay with fish seafoods and yeah oh there's a lot of uh, mayonnaise on this one but yeah yeah, yeah. I will show you you know guys uh, my stepdad when he was alive god he ate so much uh, fish and rye bread and yeah before he met my mom he did not eat rice <laughs> he just ate rye bread and he was quite healthy you know before he met my mom <coughs> yeah I will show you We'll have this as a thumbnail, I think. Um, like that? Yeah, something like that. Uh, what he would do was to slice it in half and then put something else on each half. But I will not do that now. Oh, yeah. Oh, my. Can you take uh, the beef? The one I made, the beef and, and the hot dog. I made a um, meatloaf ish from beef. And yeah, I will take 
only one 500 micrograms uh, vitamin B12 huge enough and only taking one or else we are more using uh, if I take more than 500 micrograms then I'm still awake when the time is 6 o'clock in the morning so now uh, last night I was good I slept three at 3.30 uh, yeah, I think it will take time until the vitamin B12 goes to normal. Yeah, vitamin D3 we can. <coughs> I will just show you guys. Oopsie, sorry. Oh, I did not make this. This is sausage. I will put some, I think, in on top or on this side yeah I'm a little bit tired of this now I put half of it in the freezer in this one I need it's yeah it doesn't look so hot right now uh, because I sliced it but yeah I'll show you uh, I just put ground beef in the um, oh we don't have any do we have tomatoes can I have two please sorry <laughs> Maria doesn't want to be my assistant now because she is uh, editing Give me two tomatoes, please. Uh, so that it will look healthier. Yeah, cheap. <laughs> please, uh, please wash it. Yeah, I have my so called choker. Uh, Maria made this. Sorry. Uh, yeah what my stepdad would do was like this yes <laughs> thank you oh maybe this should be the um yeah thank you so much the thumbnail wait this should be the thumbnail i think something like that I like that. Yeah. Uh, this is the meatloaf, the sausage, and the fish on rye bread. <coughs> yeah. He would l do like this and separate or slice them in half, and he would put different things on them. So that was my dad or stepdad. <laughs> for me, even though I was quarreling with him, for me he was my dad. Mm. Mm. The taste is so close to um uh there is a herring if it's called herring oh sorry for the knife sound mm. and there is a herring like this in Norway and they put cream and all that was good this is really raw guys um, I don't know if you can see oh. and usually I don't like raw fish but if it's swimming in mayonnaise then yes <laughs> mm. yeah the ground meat I just put in a pan it was two kilos ground meat and I took one cup of water and I placed 
bouillon and uh, salt um, powder uh, garlic and powder onion I forgot to put the vinegar but you should put about half half cup of vinegar Mm. I love this so I wonder how I can have it um, in yeah, I want to take it to, to the job mm. now the, the, the bread is good mm. love your bread <coughs> you should for rye bread. Mm. <laughs> Guys, I'm in heaven right now. <laughs> Since yeah the package. So overwhelming. What Michael did. Good job. Yeah. And then I let it cook for about 20 to 30 minutes. Um, you know, it's beef, and beef, does, beef doesn't take a long time to cook I just wait until um, the oil comes out then it's finished about 20 minutes something oh no uh, the machine which sweeps the streets that is strange for me that the machine comes and <laughs> oh there's a man riding it but yeah it saves them time <coughs> but I think it looks better when a person does it And they will get plenty of exercise. Right now, my you and I are eating like horses again. That's what we do when we work in <coughs> sorry. And the good thing when we have a physical work is that we can do that and still not be obese. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. It's also tiring to chew and chew, guys. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You should try this, guys. If you're living in Denmark, I think the name of that Norwegian heron is Rum Sil. I love that. If 
you're no later, you know what I'm talking about. Rum means eggs. So that fish and that herring has eggs in it, you know, red caviar. Oh, and I think the, the food in it was, or the cream is, um, you know, s not sour. Uh, grand fin something it's it's like yogurt you know oh it's so good and that's my favorite Norwegian food Lollipop. I feel so spoiled, guys. From Malta and all the jewelry season. <coughs> These are fruits, fruit, uh, dried fruits, and gourmet. He bought me gourmet everything. Um, I'll show you. But when it comes to chocolate bits, I prefer cheap ones. Uh, but I will eat it because it's from Malta. You know, uh, oh, that smells good. That's milk chocolate. I prefer this, and I'm betting this is cheaper than that, than this. And it's so heavy, guys. It's the real thing. It's handmade um, on the Oregon coast. See? Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, some of you don't like um, hard topping. Yeah, but Michael knows this about me that I prefer cheap ones. And yet they bought me gourmet things, but but this, when it comes to lollipop, yes, oh my God, buy me gourmet things. Mm. And usually, even though you buy gourmet lollipops, they will still not um, cost you so much. But as soon as it's chocolate, since it you know it's um, harder to harvest, <coughs> then it becomes so costly. So. So, sausage, this is just, you know, the big sausage and it's all cheap, yeah, yeah, I love cheap things. <laughs> That's why, I don't know why, but I mean, I wasn't close to my dad. And yet I get his jokes. I mean, I think he's asked me to. When I would make meatloaf, I would put bacon on top or um, everything. Oh, those are okay too, but as soon as you put eggs in something, it just tastes eggs and it tastes, uh, you know, if it's beef, beef has a distinct taste to it and the only thing you should put I mean to take away that uh, you know I don't know savory taste is vinegar 
and we don't have to put anything so much uh, except for spices because if you put eggs in this it would taste um, cheap or something no, I mean I love cheap things but it would taste like commercial food so if you are making it don't put eggs before I would do that <laughs> And I feel the casserole is just two kilos gone beef, so the rest, half of it, is in the freezer. Also, the sausage one because yeah, I get tired. I mean, after three days, I don't want to eat it anymore. So it's better to put in the freezer the next time I have a craving for them. Maria and I did a satire for you. I hope you watch it. And I was laughing, she was laughing when, when I edited the video because although it's, it, it's not in my schedule to upload now, I want to upload it now. I was laughing. you would find it funny too because when I do something and it becomes funny although I haven't I mean I, yeah I wanted to do a satire but you know you never know if it would be funny but every time I laugh when I'm editing you seem to like it too uh, you seem to think it's funny too so maybe we have the same taste Someone requested a windy hair video, but usually it's so windy in Denmark. Why is it not windy now? You know, vehicles, <laughs> Stephanie is Virgo too, but vehicles are very good at making stars. I mean, they are the best liars here on earth. I have met some, I mean, I don't mean Stephanie, but Maria is, um, especially since I'm asking. Finish. <laughs> 